Right, hang on. I've got a better one. I've got a way better one. Actually. Okay. So I'm gonna tell you a story about Kadra. Right? This is this is straight hot fire. Yeah, we're gonna yeah, we'll, we'll I was gonna do the switching with the mouse mat covered in piss. But what you have to find the bit where the guy makes the fucking remix. Where he took his quote, put it on fucking vinyl and scratched it up. It was hilarious. Anyway, right. So let me let me uh, let me find this for you. This we're going full screen for this one. Right. So back when I used to work at Cadred, there was a guy called Max Silver. Max Goody Silver. And Max Silver is now a professional poker player. Right? Um, and he's he's a fucking he's done well for himself. He got out of esports at the right time. Went and became a professional poker player, made a ton of money. He's obviously done way better than me. And he was like one of the original guys at like Cadred, which was, uh, you know, a, uh, it was a team website for Insignia Cadre, a very good Finnish team with like legends in it, like Angel Dust and stuff. And it became the big news portal. And when I was working there, Goody found himself victim to the best... Oh, sorry, did I miss a sub? Sorry about that, Disdain D, my bad. Uh, Goody was victim to one of the craziest pranks I've ever seen. And the video still exists on YouTube, right? So here was the thing. I got a phone call in the middle of the night. And it was from Goody. And Goody messaged me and he said, um, Hey, Rich, I need some advice. And I went, Oh, what is it, brother? You know, what's up? And he said, I'm get, uh, I, I, I think I'm going to get a job with a real newspaper. And I was like, what? And he was like, yeah, the, the Telegraph wants to do an interview with me. And you have to understand how infuriating this was for me, right? Because there I was grinding away in esports, doing the best writing on the website. I'll own that. Like, if you think that's big headed, it was, it, it's not, it's, just, it's true. Uh, right, and I was like, "What?" And they fucking lick, lick, lick my balls. Uh, cheers for the sub, lady. They they fucking looked at the website, looked at all the writers on the website, and the person they want to give a job to is Max. So I'm fuming. My vein's gone, but I, I, but he's still a mate and still someone I work with. So I'm on the phone like, "Oh, that's fucking brilliant, Max. So happy for you, like big fucking beetroot head." Pure jealousy, you know? So anyway, he's going, oh, so what should I do? What should I do? And I'm like, oh, well, listen, you know, uh, they'll probably want to see some clippings, as you call it. So take down some of your best work. Uh, one of the exercises you might get in uh, a, a, a job interview for a, uh, you know, newspaper gig is they might throw up some ideas and say, hey, you got any ideas for any articles? So have that in the back of your mind. And, you know, just talk about your experience, blah, blah, blah. So anyway, I, I, I talked him through this interview. And uh, anyway, he came back and he said, um, you know, and we didn't talk about it like a few days later. And, he, and I said, oh, what happened? And he went, oh, it was uh, nothing really. Yeah. Well, anyway, what had happened was someone had fucking pranked him. There was no job from the Telegraph and there was no interview as a result. And not only did they prank him, they recorded the prank. Now, here's the best bit. There used to be a team called uh, Five Flow. I think it was DDK's old team back when he used to play Counter-Strike Source, right? And there was a geezer in it called Kiriyama. And Kiriyama is a fucking legend. If you know about UK esports, you know who Kiriyama is, right? Like, this guy was a fucking beast. He was a you know, decent player, like, nothing amazing, but decent, was in a lot of half-decent UK teams. Went to every I-Series, and then, like, he was a drinker and a party dude and then he just turned and then he was like all about that clean living and now he's massive like big bodybuilder right all legit as well all natural just a super cool guy one of those guys who if he puts his mind to something he just does it right like mad respect for the dude so anyway kiriyama fucking recorded this call and oh it, it's too good guys it's too good so here it is and the thing the thing about this is uh like it's it's still got next to no views it's only got 3500 views and it's amazing so i'm just gonna play the whole fucking thing just watch this shit this is how we used to roll back when uk esports was fucking gangland this is the type of shit that used to go on all right it was fucking hilarious all right check this shit out 
contact with one of your uh, distributors, Cadrade, I think it's called, and we are interested in uh, your writings. Basically, we've, we're creating a new column in our Sunday Telegraph paper. Basically, it's uh, it's about well, gaming entertainment sort of much is the main thing. And we are looking for writers to write for us. We have contacted a few other people, and we're just trying to see if we can get actually anybody or not to write for us. Um, would you be interested in some or not? Uh, okay, cool. Can I just take a few of your contact details, and then I will get back to you um, whether or not you know we will go ahead with it or not. Um, uh, one sec. Can I just get your address, please? Okay, thanks a lot, sir. We will be in contact very shortly with you. Thanks a lot. Bye bye. Oh my! God. <laughs> what the hell, man? How the hell do you make that up on the sly? I'm recording. Don't worry. Hello, is this a Max Silver? Yes, it is. Hello. Um, hello. Um, I believe my com colleague phoned you a couple of weeks ago. Uh, John Chen about from the Daily Telegraph? Oh, yes. Hi, uh, my name's yeah, Alex, obviously, as well. Uh, obviously, um, he can't uh, make phone calls at the moment. He's away, but I'm doing on oh. his behalf. Basically, okay. we're trying to bring those people in for interviews and see, you know, if they're, you know, how they play along with it and stuff like that. Would you be okay to come for an interview with us? Uh, sure, yeah. Uh, okay, uh, do you live near London by any chance? I am based in London, yes. You're based in London. Uh, do you know where Buckingham uh, Palace Road is? Uh, I'll look it up the truth. Uh, basically, it's, um, it's where our, you know, our base operations is at. Was, um, is there any day in particular next week you can come down? Uh, next week is fine, I think. Sorry? Uh, yeah, next, 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 next week is fine, Any, any day in particular? Um, I think I'm doing a week, so... Uh, any time after midday, or most days, I think I'm free. Uh, Monday, say, uh, hold on one sec, let me have a look through it. Uh, Monday, 11 o'clock? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, do you want to take the address down, by the way? I will, I will. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, sure. Okay, it's 111 Buckingham Palace Road. Okay. Uh, the nearest uh, tube is Victoria. Alright, okay. I mean, uh, he's done him like a kipper. Listen to how... Just come out up, up the Listen to how professional right. this shit sounds, dude. And you'll see us on the right. It's quite a big building and our, uh, our name's across the top. The payoff on this is unreal. Yeah, if you just... Um, go just uh, obviously into reception. Ask the secretary uh, just for Alex Parker. And she'll just bring bring you up to us. And, you know, we'll have a talk through and just see what's happening and stuff. Alright, thanks a lot, Max. I'll see you Monday at 11 o'clock. Okay, thanks a lot. Goodbye. I'm the fucking Don. I'm the fucking Don! Lovely. <laughs> 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 oh, this is heartbreaking. He's actually at the office, just sat there. Hello, where were you today, Max? <laughs> You didn't what? I was there. Wait, sorry, who is this? This is uh, Alan. Alan? Yeah. Um, I was there at 11 o'clock and you didn't show. No? Are you, are you sure you went to the right building? Because we were, um, me and my partner were down there for half an hour. Um, are you sure? I was there for what, 30 minutes. Were you? Yeah. You went, which, which building did you go to? The one on uh, Buckingham uh, Palace Road, yeah? Did you, did you go to reception or did you ask for them? I did, yeah. What did they say? Sorry? What did they say? Said, uh, um, your name wasn't on the list, so I have staff, I think. I WANNA FUCK YOUR FATHER'S ASSHOLE! THEN I WILL FUCK YOUR MOTHER'S ASSHOLE! DO BURA BYE! BURA BYE BYE! David? BURA BYE BYE! BURA! BURA BYE BYE! BURA! <laughs> oh, you should do it at the end. Oh, fucking hell, mate. What was you doing at the end? Fuck me. What an absolute fucking... Oh, my God. Oh. That is how we used to fucking roll in UK fucking Counter-Strike back in the day, dudes. Like, that was it. Like, 
understand Max is the editor in chief for like the biggest website in the scene and he just got done like that oh bye bye I fucking love it mate too good that shit's too good oh so there you go there, there's an i series story for you all right <coughs> uh.